Good morning, everybody. I hope you have been enjoying the videos that I've been putting out. Um, I finally got that replacement box that I was supposed to get from um, my favorite place. And this might end up being the last um, box that I get from them because, like I said, the prices have become so unreasonably extraordinarily high, I might not be able to afford to get anything anymore from them. But we will see. I'm going to be optimistic about it. Again, don't forget to smash the like button. I would really appreciate that. Um, share if you can and um, comment. Now remember if you see something that you you like um, put a time stamp and a brief description okay of what the item is and we'll go from there. So now I never got a bag. This is the only one in the box that's like this. I would assume this is probably two bags. Um, but I've never gotten a bag like this before from them. So, and these are all individual bags in here. So, we will see. It sort of looks promising. We will see what uh, could be in this bag. And uh, let's get started. All right, let's start with this one here. This has got a few items in it. We'll see what we have. Okay. Let me dump this out carefully. All right. I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. I'm enjoying the, um, the sunshine here in New York. I hope it lasts for a while. And uh, we will see. Okay, this looks like um, all, all bracelets, stretch bracelets, and then I have a couple of glass bracelets in here. So we'll go through these. Very cute, some of these. Oh, this one here. Yeah, this is glass, too, over, I think, over acrylic. Okay. All right, so let's, let me show you these stretch bracelets. This one here has um, um, an angel and a uh, dove and a different bunch of crosses um, stretch on it's okay uh, it's all glass we have that one all right this one's acrylic and this is big and bold and beautiful stretches really good on this one I think it's pretty okay and this was glass also. And the stretch on this is very nice. All glass. Okay. Um, another one all glass. These are actually pretty nice. I hope you can see these good. I keep moving my setup around to try to get, get things better, but it, I don't know. I go back and I look at the video and try to see what I can do to improve it. This one here is very nice. All right, these are all art beads, but these gold tone beads that are in between it are peeling. So this one I would take for beads because these beads here are glass and they're too beautiful to let go. Um, this is glass also. This is large. And this is stretched out. This one isn't a stretch bracelet. This is going to the thrift. Um, it's glass, but it's it's put, been put on a wire instead of put on put on um, beading thread or beading wire. So it's it's wonky. And we have a nice. Um, this is on um, on stretch. Uh, what do you call it? Um, the cloth covered cord. And this is a hematite. This is very, very nice. Okay. And here's another stretch. It's got a little heart on it. This is very large. I think you could use this 
as an anklet. Okay. I will probably, let me, when I get done with this, I will go through and I will bundle together. This one is, is, is beautiful glass beads, but it's all stretched out. This one's good. This is silver tone with uh, cat's eyes. Okay. And finally, we have this one. Stretch is great on this. Um, somebody, if somebody made this, they put some work into it. We have um, clear quartz, green adventuring, gold stone. Um, I think this is sodalite, more of the clear. Um, this is an agate, rose quartz. This is very light. I'm not sure what this is. This is an agate. And we go back again. And then you have dangles hanging all around with little stone chips. This is very, very, very nice. All right. So this will go separate. And then we have a really nice cuff bracelet. Okay, done in blues and silver. This is all glass. This is really pretty. Okay. I like that. Put that over there. And then this one here. This is cold. This appears to have an acrylic on the inside with it married to... It's Oh, but it's not ice cold, but it looks like glass to me. It's got some weight. Very, very beautiful bangle. I got to get that out. That's where the price tag was. And this is done in brown, silver, and yellow. This is pretty. Okay. So we'll put that over there. Um, I think we'll, we'll do the hematite bracelet separately. Um, but I think this... Oh, we have one more here. This is um, this is on cord, and uh, it's just a thing that would go on your wrist like that. Um, it's a little funky, so I'm going to put it in with these. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's put all these together. Now, we'll put nine together. Now, wait a minute. Let's leave that one separate. So, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll sell these as a lot. Now, some of them the stretch is good on. I think there's only two in here that the stretch is not great on. But, if you need beads, I mean, really, really nice. Some, there's some nice art beads in here. Um, we got cubes and all kinds of different beautiful beads. So we'll put these together. Like I said, the other one here is going to go to the thrift. All right, I'm going to put these back in this bag. So we keep them together. All right. Put that over there. And let's get it back into the bag and grab something else out. Okay, this is very pretty. This is all glass also. This is an illusion necklace, and it is in perfect condition. Um, this is done all in greens. Um, it's on gold tone wire. Beads are glass. Um, it's very, very pretty. Um, let me see here. we got to get the extender out. It's wrapped around the cords here. Oh, this one, I'm going to have to work on this. But anyway, um, this is nice. This one here has just gotten tangled up inside of this one wire here. So I'll have to get that out. But here you go. This is really beautiful. I don't know if you can see it. And it's not all kinked up. And it's one of the few that's got these big, beautiful, chunky glass beads on it. All right, so let me put that away. Oh. Today I'm watching stuff on Everest. Um, I'm kind of intrigued about Mount Everest. Again, the climbing thing, I guess. Not without even really realizing it. Okay, i got a lot of work to get accomplished today. All right, let's see what this pretty little necklace is. Now, I looked at the other bags. I didn't op open anything up or go through anything. But the other ones are all in their normal bag. 
So, okay. This is a three strand silver tone necklace and it has this great big pretty pendant on it. Um, I have to, I don't know if they're glass or they're resin or whatever, but they're really pretty. I will give you a close up of that. Um, lengthwise, we have 16 inch with a nice long extender. Um, this is an excellent condition. There's the pendant. Take a look at those. Yeah. They're definitely, I think the metal is colder then, so these are probably a resin that were poured into these forms. But it's really beautiful. It's really a beautiful necklace. I like that one. I'll put that one back in the bag. It take, might not take too long to go through all this. Because everything is in... I never got a bag like this before from them. All right. All right. This is heavy. Whatever this is, it's very, very, very heavy. Wow. This is pretty. Okay. Let me see if I see a clasp. Um... No, I don't see a clasp. I think this just goes right over your head. All right. And I will give you a measurement on that. I could be wrong. All right. This is... Um, this is a big, beautiful bead down here. And these are all glass. Um, we have... Let's see. One... One, two, three, four, five chains with this big, beautiful clasp. This is the clasp, okay? So, there you go. I didn't even realize that till I turned it over. So, you could wear this, like laying this on the side. You could put it behind your neck if you want, but why, why hide something so beautiful? Okay, I hope you're seeing all this. I'm going to give you a measurement on it. This is a beautiful, beautiful necklace. And it's long. And I'll give you a close-up. Alright, so we have 12. 12. And I'd say about 3. So, if, so it's a 30-inch necklace. Alright, let me... It's just got weight. Let me tell you. You can tell this is quality. Alright, put that there. You can see this has almost got like a tiger effect in it. And there's all these beautiful little glass beads. Very, 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 very pretty necklace. Alright, we'll put that away. Put my bag back up here. Alright, I don't want to get this all tangled up. So I want to put it back in the bag right. All right. Okay. Now we have um, a seed bead necklace with an art glass pendant on it. Um, if I can get it out of the bag. Um, let me measure the necklace for you. This is a really nice pendant on this one. This is one of the better made ones that I've seen in a long time. A uh, 16 inch necklace with a 3 inch extender. And this is what it looks like. Whoops. I just lost Mr. Pirate's little hat there. Okay. So this is a... Um, I don't want to... I think it's more of a bronze color seed bead. And in here you've got white and yellow and the cobalt blue with the bronze in the background that matches this. Um, this is very, very nice pendant. Um, I'm usually not a big fan of these pendants, but this one happens to be very pretty. And it's thick and it's made very nicely. So we have that. Okay, can you see that? Great. 
All right, put that away. Maybe there'll be some surprises in here. Now we have another one of those. This is one of your more common ones, and this is just on a, on a, I would, I would get this just for the pendant, and um, I don't know, the cord is so-so. The pendant is pretty, though. It's got uh, blues and silver and brown, and this is probably the same as far as the length. Yeah, I don't like this. Yeah, it's 16 inches. And um, it's got ribbon and, and wax cotton cord, but the pendant is very pretty. So we have that. There might be a bunch of these in here. Who knows? I see more as I'm digging. I'm getting down. Maybe they did all this like this because this bag was a lot of glass, and they didn't want it to get. Boy, this sucker's heavy. Oh my goodness gracious! They didn't want to get it all broken. Wow. Wow. Okay. I'm saying wow because I can't believe how heavy this pendant is. It's on a very long chain. Okay. Let's see. There's no... Ex is there an extender? Yes, there is an extender. I don't know why. Chain is unbelievably long. All right. So there's 12 and 6. 36-inch chain. I'm going to show you. The chain is, is, is just a nice plain old Rolo chain. But here's the pendant. And this is glass. And it is heavy. It's got um, oh, a lot of colors in here. Here's your chain. Okay. And uh, it's got the extender. Let me put it in my hand close up. So hopefully you can see this. Look at the colors in this. This thing is heavy. All right. And look at it. It's the size of the palm of my hand. This is pretty. Okay. Let me put this back in the baggie. Yeah, what I got on right now is about the um, earthquake in Nepal. All right. This is another pendant, glass pendant on a seed bead. And uh, this has got a lot of strands. It's put together nicely. And this one here is um, eight and a half. So this is going to be a 17 inch um, necklace. Okay. Um, in here we have brown, black, silver. And in here we have brown and black and silver. Okay. Um, very pretty pendant. This is a very heavy weighted pendant okay and it's got a nice seed bead um, necklace that it goes with you see all those colors very pretty these will all still be cleaned and sanitized okay and put into better bags I'm not gonna do you know not just because they're all individually wrapped I'm not gonna leave them in these bags all right, let's see now. Okay, now this is, let's hope when I open this up, this is all together. I'm afraid to look at this. Okay, now, this is, I don't know if this is supposed to be hooked together or not, but, I don't think so. I think I got to get this off of here because one has a clasp and the other one doesn't. And this is unfortunately, let me see here. Hang on, I'm getting it, getting it. All right. So we have this necklace, and this is all glass. All right, these are a pink bead. Um, these are pretty. And then we have this one, which has, this is all done on a string. These are beautiful. Um, string looks pretty good. 
Let me see what's going on with this clasp. There's something in the clasp. Hang on. Oh, this needs a jump ring. I will do that. It's not a bad thing. All right. The jump ring came off at the one end. All right, so this is big also. Okay. Gorgeous crystal beads. Very feminine, very delicate, very dainty. So, right here is where, and it's clean. Right here is where I need to put a jump ring right there to go into the lobster claw clasp. Um, this one, let's see here. My goodness gracious, this is long. Um, 36 inches. Let me put this in my hand. Let me show you the shimmer and shine. These are pink glass beads, and they have an Aurora Borealis finish on them. They are gorgeous. And this one here is 12 and 9. 21. This is 42 inches. This one here. This is all well articulated. They're all, so is the other one. These are all individual beads all along on here. So it just, you know, just drops really, really nice. And this has got weight because it's all glass. So we have that. All right, let me get these. I'm going to put this in a bag by itself because uh, I want to fix this. And the other one I'll just put to the side. And it just needs a nice jump ring. Okay. And this one I'll put over here with these goodies. Okay. Now we got an acrylic piece. Wow, first piece of acrylic. But it's pretty. These are all articulated also. And um, let me see here. This needs, this needs some work. I just need to put this back to, um, this is a very easy fix. It just came apart. This is old. All right. This is very old. This is not new. These are all, um, it's almost, I don't know what the color I would call this. Uh, like a blue topaz color. Yeah, they're acrylic. But they're very nice. And I just have to put the two two pieces back together again. So we have this. This is beautiful. Um, as you can see the color of it there. And it is very long. Very, very long. And it's very fluid. Very, very fluid. Okay. I'm going to put this in its bag and put it over here. So I can, before I'm done with this, I will put everything That has to be fixed. Okay. This one here. Yeah, there's a lot of glass pendants in here. Okay. This is a piece of wax cotton cord. Not in anything fancy, but pretty. All right. And this is the pendant. It's a small um, glass pendant. And uh, it's got uh, greens and golds and rust color. Okay, and it's fairly long. I would take this off and put this on something different. Because this is pretty. This is a pretty bead. Alright, we have that. Yeah, there's a lot of pendants in here. A lot of glass pendants. That's why they put all this together. Alright. Getting there. This one's different. what I was expecting but this is a pretty pendant let me show you this pendant I don't know if you can see that really well very very nice all right all glass beads seed beads are glass this is also on a bronze and this has the burnt orange going around okay, here's the back and let me show you on here I don't know if you can see that or not 
It's just a pretty pendant. This one here looks like it's maybe a little bit longer than the others. Um, maybe not. Oh yeah, it is. It definitely is. This is 18 inches, not counting the pendant. And this one's very pretty. This is also very heavy, and this one has an extender on it. Okay, getting down to more glass pendants. All right, let's see what this is. I think this has thrift written all over it. No, maybe not. This is kind of pretty now that I look at it. Okay. All right, it's another necklace that's done on a wire. These are acrylic, um, but they're all done and they're they're hung so that they come to a V. It's sort of cute. All right. All right, we have that. Let me take this apart. Okay. And the wire's not bent. So, really pretty color combination of the, um, sort of like a gray, a red, a gray-purplish, I would say. Red and uh, the frosted white. If I can get it back in the bag now. Come on, go. Scoop, scoop, get in there. All right, okay. Let's grab this one. This is another one. Let me see what's in here. This is all pendants. As far as, oh my God. Oh my God. All right, I have, oh my goodness gracious. I have three glass pendants, okay? This one is just, um, um, you know, a rectangle. This one is a spoon type. They're all good. And look at this one here, this little ladybug, all done out of glass. And then, let's see what this said. I might have to keep this one. I don't know why, but he's just he's just too adorable for words. This is all done out of glass. Look at this little froggy. Oh my goodness gracious. How sweet and cute is that? Oh, I love him. I think I'll I'll keep him for a while and then maybe I'll share him at a later date. He is adorable. Okay, let me put him to the side. And I'm going to put these, I don't want this to get broken, this, especially the ladybug. Oh my goodness gracious, how cute. All right. All right, got that. Now we have another one. How are we doing on time? Oh, we're good. We're going to get through this bag with plenty of time to spare. All right, we have a, um, this is a ribbon, okay, it's your typical ribbon. But we have a really pretty, um, heavy, heavy black, copper, and silver pendant. I would buy this just for the pendant if you're interested. Um, and it's very pretty. Black in the back. And it's heavy. Very, very, very heavy. All right, that's that one. These both are in the same bag here. Oh, boy, this is beautiful. Wow. Okay, I'm looking for a clasp. Yes, there is one. All right, let me put this up, Bertha. I got to go get my big thing out of the car. I keep saying that, but if I go out for any reason this weekend, I will get it. This is done on some kind of a golden thread. All right, and these are all, there's foil beads, there's crystal beads, um, and look at these rugs here with the roses in them. Hearts with roses. Beautiful. And a lot of different colors and stuff in here. I'm going to give you a close-up of this and a measurement. This is very, very, very pretty. And it's long. Um, it's all hand-knotted. 
Okay, I'm, I can't tell you how pretty this is. I would wear this. All right, 12 and 2, so 26 inches. Look at these peep, these beads with the flowers in them. This is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. And there's your beads. All glass. Look at the foil. Look at the flowers. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, i got to put this in a separate bag from the other one. Okay. We are almost there. Let's see what this is. Oh, this is interesting. This is uh, short. This one here is 16 inches. This is definitely going to be a choker. Gorgeous, though. Look at this. These are all glass beads. It's striking with the color combination of the black um, chain running through all these beautiful pink glass crystal beads. So, so nice. Um, it's got a toggle clasp. All right, let me put this in my hand so you can see how pretty this is. Look at the sparkle on these. Lots of chatoyancy. All right, very, very pretty, pretty, pretty necklace. That's a lot of glass. Okay, very nice. All right. I'm liking this so far. I'm not a big fan on the on all the you know the glass pendants. But I know, oh wow, a lot of people love these. Oh my goodness. This is the kind of stuff that will make you a fan. Let's hope this is all in one piece. Holy crow. Oh my god. Let me see. If this is... Oh wow. At first I thought it was broke. It's got a real funky kind of a clasp, but it is not broke. Look at this pendant. At this art glass pendant. It is beautiful. These are wooden beads. These are acrylic flowers. Makes you want to think you should be in Tahiti somewhere. And then it's finished off with a gold chain. And it's got one of these. Really, It's just a single little thing that you pull out. And you push into here for the um, um, the closure. This is really pretty. And it's a good thing that these are, are made out of wood. Because this pendant is very, very, very heavy. Very heavy. Okay, so that's a surprise. Okay, let's put that in the bag. Oh, I can't believe they just put all this glass in this one bag like this. All right, now, what do we have here? All right, we have this one here needs something. It needs some love. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 this is mine. Oh, oh, look at this. I'm sure somebody has seen this before. This is a fish bowl. And in the fish bowl, there's fish. There's a fish. And this is a kitty cat looking up. And it's a brooch. And I think it's, a, um, from the back of it, I think it's a 1928 brooch. Oh, my graciousness. Oh, thank you. I love this. I'm keeping it. Now, this one, other one in here is broken. And there's no way that I can fix it. And um, so this is going to have to go. I don't even want to take the chance. This was a very delicate, it was a very delicate little point set of all made out of glass. And one of the petals is off. And it was $5.00. 
Now this is glass, but the, um, maybe it isn't glass, maybe it's acrylic, I think it's acrylic. Um, somebody is handy and wants to put um, a bale on the back of this, you're welcome to try. This is really a pretty flower. And you could put this on a substantial necklace. Um, this would just take a glue-on bale. I might be able to do that. If anybody's interested in this beautiful flower, let me know because if you are, I will turn around and I will put a bale on the back of it for you so you can use it as a pendant. All right, let me put these away. We are down to the end of the bag. We're at 35. I gotta push it here. There's a lot in this bag, more than I thought. Okay, let's do this last. Let me take these last three things out. I don't know what this is. Glass jewelry, that's exactly what this says. Okay, we have three more. This is a beautiful pendant. This is your tipple. This one's an 18-incher. This has got a beautiful pink rose. It's on a black cord. It looks new. Okay, so we have that. All right. Let me put that here. Then we have this one. All right. This is a pretty pendant. This is just on a black cord with gold toned findings. Beautiful gold glass pendant. This has actually got a name in it. Um, where's my thing? Let's see what this says. Yeah, this is Murano glass. This one. So, this is an expensive piece of glass. All right, and there's your gold tone. And right there is where it says Murano glass. Never seen one of these pendants that said Murano glass on them before. All right, we've got to take care of that. And this just got to go back in the bag. And then there's two rings here. And then earrings. All right. This is a beautiful piece of dichroic glass that somebody unfortunately put on one of these adjustable rings but it's still pretty okay and then we have this one which is all glass all right and this one here is there's it's basically black brown um, copper silver and greens very pretty pretty ring all right, so we have those two. I can't believe that kitty cat brooch is in this bag. It's so untypical of everything else that's in the bag. All right, and this here we have, let me put this to the side. This here, it looks like they had had this for sale on the website and um, and maybe it didn't sell or something. I don't know. Now, these earrings here um, match that necklace. This is the same thing that that necklace has. Remember in the beginning, it's underneath the, the whole pile, so I can't. These The earrings alone were listed at $14. So these will go with the necklace. Um, let's see what else we have here. We have a pair of hoop dangles with frost it's like kind of sea glass beads they're kind of pretty um, we have these these are not bad cat eye pink pink cat eye beads three articulated um, dangles we have these um, these might be might be silver they sure look like it. Okay. These are, the, are black. With some silver going around and some other beads. Very pretty. Um, these are beautiful. Um, these are really beautiful. 
Can you see these? This is kind of like a opaque, um, light, very pale green, and then these are green stones. There's a pattern on the back. It doesn't look like 1928, but these are a pretty earring, and they dangle very nice. These are beautiful. Um, I think they're glass. Okay, let me see if I can get them together. All right, these are like a crystal drop with some crystals up above, and there's how they dangle. These are these would be nice for a bride. All right, now I have a pair of amethyst earrings, and uh, this is them. They have a little chip and then um, an amethyst nugget at the bottom, and we have. These, these are just glass beads. Okay, they're red. Orangish red, but really red. And we have these glass. This has been a pretty nice slot, all in all. These are like a smoky topaz color. Very dangly. And then there's these really old ones here. Um, these are screw backs. And let's see if I can get you to see these to dangle. Very, very, very pretty little earrings. Okay, and there's the screw backs. I will have to check them out. So, that is it. And um, I'm actually pretty pleased with... Uh, I'm sure that this bag is, uh, is two bags. So there's probably only eight more bags in the box. Because this was a large lot. And it was a pleasure going through this because everything, you know, is paired up and um, everything was bagged. So, now I'm going to put everything back in the bag and then I will turn around and get this all cleaned at some point. Alright, I'm going to put these rings in with the earrings. So again, please, don't forget to hit, hit the like button. I would really appreciate that. Um, it helps the channel out, and um, also share if you can would be really nice. And uh, if you want something, remember, um, just comment with uh, the timestamp and a brief description of the item that you're interested in. What happens, what a lot of you guys don't realize, is when I click on the timestamp, sometimes you watch the piece right to the end and then what happens when I hit the timestamp it comes up in between items so I'm not sometimes I'm not totally sure what item it is but I normally go back to the item that was before it so it really helps if you put a brief description okay that is it I hope everybody has a great day and I'll keep looking forward to putting out nice content for you and uh, stay safe out there be mindful of people around you and I will be in touch soon take care of yourselves bye bye